when you run Linux on your computer and you would rather be greeted by this than by this, then you need a display manager. Today I'm going to talk about SDDM display manager. And this is what you see here. So how do you set up SDDM on your machine? Well, first you need to install it. Usually the package is called SDDM. So you can install it with your distro package manager. The second thing you want to do is to actually check which display manager you are currently running. Which display manager you are currently running, you can check with this command. And as you can see here, it will tell me that I'm using SDDM. If I were to run this on other machine that is not running SDDM, I can see that this machine is running like DM. In this case, you want to stop anything that you are currently running. To do that, you want to stop that service. If you are on system D, this will be your command. If you run this command now, you will see that no display manager is currently set up to run on your machine. Now you need to enable SDDM and you can do that with this command. And if you check your display manager service, you will see that it's SDDM. And that is basically all you need to do to have SDDM run on your machine as display manager. But that is not all, because you will probably want to put some team on your SDDM. You can get teams at KDE store under SDDM login teams. And for instance, if you choose this team, you click on it and you can see how it looks. You download the file. When you download your team, you want to extract it and copy it to user share SDDM teams folder. If you just want to copy your team to the right folder, you need to open Dolphin as administrator. And for that, you need that Kai or something plugin. Then it will ask you for your password. Now you just go to your downloads and copy the folder here. If you want to have avatars, which is this little picture here for your user, you will download those pictures and put them into user share SDDM basis. And then you would choose in the config file which one you want. So how do you set your SDDM team if you don't have KDE? Go to this file, etsy sddm conf. Now I'm on Fedora and I don't know if this is the default file, how it looks, or this is something Fedora puts, but I will try to make it short. This is the default theme of SDDM. Here are some options that you can define for your SDDM team. If you want to log into your Linux session without needing to type in the password, you can just uh, put here the name of the user. Also, you can define some of these options like for shutdown, which command will be used for reboot. And under a team, you can define which team you want to use. You can also define the cursor team that you want to see uh, when SDDM is running. Here you defined your Wayland sessions and here you defined your X11 sessions. So what are the sessions? Sessions are this. Basically you choose uh, which desktop environment or window manager you want to use and do you want to be Wayland or X11. To define a session, you put it in user share Wayland session. And if you look for my, for instance, Hyperland desktop sessions, you can see it's just uh, starting Hyperland. The same is for X11 sessions. They have their own folder. I currently have only uh, Plasma X11. But for instance, if I would install i3, I would put my desktop file here. As you can see here, everything is commented and there is a lot of junk. So here is the cleaned up version of my SDDM uh, config file. And if you only want to change the theme, and this is only what you are interested, this is the line that is most important for you. And this is the line that you only want to change. So this theme, 
Arch Linux Simplicity. As you can see, it's in my SDDM Teams uh, folder. So let's say you downloaded multiple Teams and you don't remember how they look. To preview an SDDM team, you can run this command where this is the name of the team. So if I run this command, I can see how the team will look. And if I'm happy with it, I can just put it in my Etsy SDDM com file. If not, I can just look for another team. To exit this screen, the only way I know how is to go back to console and press Ctrl C. If you know how to exit the test mode without killing it, just tell me in the comments below. And when you pick the team that you like, you can just uh, change it here in Etsy SDDM com file under team, current team, and the name of the team. And if you are on KDE, usually what the distributions will do is uh, ship with SDDM by default, and then you just go to your system settings, call teams, login screen, SDDM, and here you just decide uh, which team you want to use, plus you go on get new, and you don't have to go to KDE Store, but install it from here. And that's all.